up everyone welcome to a brand new movie review today i'm discussing a smaller independent film today called the wife the film stars jeffrey price and glenn close and of course glenn close plays the wife of jeffrey price's character within this film and the whole film centers around a wife who's traveling with her husband to stockholm as he's receiving a nobel peace prize for his literature awards and with all the books he's written but on this trip she starts to reconsider her life and her marriage with this man. The story does sound very typical-ish, drama-ish, and it could end up being a, a very melodramatic drama that just turns out to be just an okay film, but the fact is, is I didn't know really much about this film. I didn't even know the story. I knew the title and who was in it, and I went into this film with a very open mind, and man, this might be one of my favorite films of this year. I'm very surprised by this, but this film that the director does such a good job directing within this thing, and the cinematography is superb, but the most important thing about this film is, is how riveting and intriguing the whole film is. So I've never been so hinged on every word of dialogue, every moment to moment happening within the story, like I was within this film. This is the first film that I would even go as far to say that I think deserves Oscar consideration, because Glenn Close gives one of the best performances of this year, hands down. Down. Probably the most powerful female performance right now. Jeffrey Price goes as far to say that he's one of the best performances as well this year. He's wonderful. He's fantastic. And just seeing the character study between these two characters and their marriage and how it works, it felt so realistic. It felt so real. The whole film feels realistic and real. It, it, it gave me that feeling of how Call Me By Your Name made me feel like a fly on the wall. The same thing happens with this film. When you're watching it, you don't see the actors or the actresses portraying these characters. You just see the characters and their events going. It feels like you're just sitting right there with with them especially how the film portrays itself as a ticking time bomb in a sense with the story when you know something's going to go wrong from the second the film opens up it's just very ticking ish it's this ticking time bomb just can, keeps continuing you get more riveted and more intrigued within the story I was very intrigued from the start of this film to the end Nothing ever pulled me out, nothing pulled me away and even though the film can be a little bit predictable at moments predictable moments actually help because you never know when they're gonna happen. Again, goes to the ticking time bomb-esque of this film, and once that bomb finally goes off, it's intriguing to see how the director shook up the camera a bit in different types of styles and different various ways as the film's unhinging itself in different manners. Kind of hard to describe it without you guys actually seeing the film, but once you see the film, really look out for that. Saying this, look out for this film. Again, this is one of the most powerful films I've seen this year with the powerful character study from both these actors, from a great relationship, from something that just seems like you're watching it right from the center, right? You're, like you're in the room watching every single moment happen. You know, you also have a great supporting cast and your Christian Slater pops up. He's fantastic as well. And just overall, I was just so riveted. And I, that's the main word that you can really center around this movie. It really shows and goes behind layers of what actual marriage is and how such a happy marriage could really be toxic with inside of it. And seeing that toxicity pop out is the thing that really just grabbed me. Grasped me and did not let me go to the end of this film where I could finally have a sigh of relief. I'm saying this all about a drama. Like, it's very powerful for a drama to be able to do that for me. Again, this is one of the best films of this year. Please search this out. It is coming out the theaters very soon. I cannot recommend this film enough. To all that said, I'm going to give The Wife an A-. Tell me, guys, have you guys seen The Wife yet? Have you heard about this film? Let's talk about it down below in the comments. And also, guys, hit up Sandwich on Films also down there because right down there you guys can get into advanced movie screens. You can also check out some movie news and also some great movie reviews. Guys, of course, until next time, stay classy. <laughs>